This is an intestinal epithelial cell present between blood and intestinal lumen. The blood has high Na plus ion concentration and low K plus ion concentration. The cytosol of intestinal epithelial cell has low Na plus ion concentration and high K plus ion concentration. The intestinal lumen has dietary glucose and high dietary Na plus ion and Cl minus ion concentrations. This is the apical membrane of intestinal epithelial cell. These apical membranes face towards the intestinal lumen. This portion of intestinal epithelial cell is called as microvillar membrane. The microvillar membrane has two Na plus glucose symporter. In the first stage of transcellular transport, one glucose and two Na plus ions present in the intestinal lumen are symported by the two Na plus glucose symporter. As a result of this symport, one glucose and two Na plus ions reach to the cytosol of intestinal epithelial cell. Here, the glucose is imported via two Na plus glucose symporter against its concentration gradient. The intestinal epithelial cell has also a basolateral or serosal membrane. The basolateral or serosal membrane faces towards blood. The basolateral or serosal membrane has Na plus K plus ATPH. The Na plus K plus ATPH is found exclusively in the basolateral or serosal membrane. In presence of Na plus K plus ATPH, the cytosolic ATP is converted into ADP and PI. After this conversion, the cytosolic Na plus ion, which is symported via 2 Na plus glucose symporter, is transported through Na plus K plus ATPase and reach to the blood. In the steady state, all the cytosolic Na plus ions symported via 2 Na plus glucose symporter from the intestinal lumen are transported through Na plus K plus ATPase and reach to the blood. As a result of this Na plus ion transport via Na plus K plus ATPase, the low intracellular Na plus ion concentration is maintained. The basolateral or serosal membrane has GLUT2. GLUT2 is an unipotor. In the second stage of transcellular transport, the cytosolic glucose transported via 2 Na plus glucose symporter are transported by GLUT2 and reaches to the blood. The transport of glucose via GLUT2 is down the glucose concentration gradient. The transport of glucose via GLUT2 is a facilitated diffusion. The K plus ion present in the blood are transported through non-gated K plus channels. The non-gated K plus channels are not shown here. Due to the transport of K plus ion from blood to the cytosol of intestinal epithelial cell, a negative membrane potential is generated inside the plasma membrane. Both the Na plus concentration gradient and negative membrane potential are used to uptake of glucose from the intestinal lumen by 2 Na plus glucose symporter. The net result of this two-stage process is movement of Na plus ions glucose from the intestinal lumen across the intestinal epithelial cell into the blood.
in between two adjacent intestinal epithelial cells tight junction is present the tight junction prevent the diffusion of na plus glucose back into the intestinal lumen as a result the na plus and glucose move into the blood please like subscribe and share